a game of colossal importance and a stadium packed to the rafters. We can't ask for any more. How could it be otherwise when two high-level sides go head-to-head -head and toe-to-toe? -to -toe? This is football out of the very top draw. Don't move a muscle. The excitement is coming up next on EA TV. And a warm welcome. Our venue today is the Etihad Stadium here in Manchester. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, and ready to provide expert analysis alongside me is Stuart Robson. And it's all about action from the Premier League in this case. It is Manchester City up against Newcastle United. Yes, thanks as always, Derek. We've got two good teams here, so I'm... A Bad challenge, and now it's up to the referee in terms of what to do next. Well, a yellow card so early in this one, Stuart. Well, it doesn't matter how early it is in the game. That's a poor challenge and deserve the booking. De Bruyne, trying his luck, and it's come off the keeper, and holding on to it at the second time of asking. Well, not many would debate the point that Erling Haaland is a joy to watch whenever he's out there on the pitch, but what should we expect from him today, Stuart? Well, he's their leading goal scorer because his space awareness in tight areas is so good. He just has that knack of knowing where the ball will drop, and I'm not sure you can teach that. De Bruyne. He's blocked it! Trippier. Fabian Scher. Burn. Botman. Sven Botman. Trippier now. Gimaraes. Newcastle moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? Trippier. Cutting in. Able to close down the shot. Ederson, wonderful goalkeeping. Now well, the short corner routine. Almiron. Oh, that's a super piece of defending. Might be able to get in behind the defence. Pulls it back. Great defending. Superbly read and executed. Almiron just wasn't going to give that ball away. Very alert defending to put a stop to the chance. We've had a pair of car keys handed in at reception. A pair of car keys and a wallet. If those are your items, please collect them Diesch. after the game. Thank you. Ederson. Alvarez Holland the ball with Rodri Ruben Dias Gvardiol and they've given him too much space having to shoot vital intervention Sven Bachmann. It's Dan Byrne. 
Gordon. The delivery. And they deal with the threat this time. Keeping possession of the ball with authority. Guimaraes. Wilson. It is a decent looking attack here. Trippier. Now with Wilson. Element of risk there, but he's won the ball. Edison. And it's through Ben Diash. And playing it back. Not a complicated save for Edison to make. Holland Oh big chance And he's kept it out fully stretched somehow reaching it Well they've been frustrated for quite a while now but these fans have suddenly come to life Played over. And a goal to give them the lead. They have their reward. Well, I think that shows what a good rapport he has with the players. Well, here it is again. It's a well-delivered ball into the box. And it ends up with a fairly simple finish. Certainly not much the goalkeeper can do about that. Well, he knows that could prove to be a massive goal. Just look at his reaction. Go to Manchester City. And so the half-time whistle is sounded here in Manchester. Well, in typical fashion, Erling Haaland asking plenty of questions of the defence in the first half. Difficult to contain, Stuart. Well, I'm sure the manager will be delighted with him. He'll have drilled it into them to keep their focus, keep playing through to the half-time whistle, and it's certainly put them in a good position to go on and win this now. Back in business and work to do for the Magpies in this second half. And given away. Almiron. Vadiol, great effort to keep that one in play. Ruben Dias. Under pressure, doesn't seem to be bothering him. Another successful intervention, winning the ball back. Ruben Dias. The ball with Rodri. Alvarez. And the challenge halts them in their tracks. Holland. Kevin De Bruyne on the move. Foden. Well, 
Well, he so badly wanted to net another one, but the keeper playing his part. Well, maybe that should have been his second, but you can see another one coming. He's playing so well here. Well, the card is out, and it's yellow. Yeah, it's clumsy, and it's late. Definitely a yellow card. Who's going to get on the end of it? Well, not away properly. Foden. Firing it in. And now the goal the City fans wanted to see. It's hard to see them throwing this away. Well, they love him and he loves them. It's great scenes here. Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. Just watch his technique here. He just hits through the back of the ball with such power. There's no stopping that. Well, that's just what he wanted. He has to be happy with this performance. They've been good today. So, 2-0 now. Number 47, Phil Foden. Almiron. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Vardiol Doku De Bruyne Holland Happy to take on the shot Well the post getting in the way there Teammate available Foden, on to Haaland, great defending, and saved by the keeper. Now they're going to alter things, here's the substitution. And a short corner, let's see. Very quick thinking there. De Bruyne, on to Holland. Almiron. Throw in then for Newcastle. A change in the offing for City. And defending as a unit. Diesch. Gvardiol. The ball with Rodri. Well, they're quite content to knock it around inside their own half. And a throw in coming up for Newcastle. Ten minutes to go. Well, no two ways about it, Stuart. City absolutely cruising to victory today. Well, they've controlled most of the game, haven't they? Their one and two touch passing has been sharp. The movement's been bright and they've scored some good goals. They just need to keep their concentration through to the final whistle. Gordon good physical play Botman Longstaff and there it breaks down but credit to the defence Holland. here's Alvarez 
Well, very effective play in possession. Well, the referee has instructed the fourth official to put two minutes on the board. This could be troublesome. Oh, but cutting it out in the nick of time. And so the referee blows the whistle. It is the end of the contest. And the three points go to Manchester City. Well, fairly comfortable in the end, wasn't it? Thought they controlled the middle of the park well. Going forward, there was some really nice incisive play too. It's a good result for them. Well, Erling Haaland performing in line with our general expectations, I think it's fair to say. Well, he was a major reason why they won today. He was so reliable and he inspires those around him.